ओके एवरी वन वी हैव क्रैक द कंसेप्ट ऑफ स्ट्रिंग्स बट अंडरस्टैंडिंग थेरी इज द फर्स्ट स्टेप इट्स टाइम टू टेस्ट आर नॉलेज सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस पी वाई क्यू एस फ्रॉम बोथ सैम्पल पेपर्स एज वेल एज एक्चुअल बोर्ड एग्जाम्स बट बिफोर दैट लेट्स गेट एन आइडिया ऑफ द वेटेज एंड टाइप्स ऑफ द क्वेश्चन देर आर हाई चांसेस ऑफ गेटिंग अ क्वेश्चन ऑन स्लाइसिंग एज वेल एज वन आउटपुट बेस्ड क्वेश्चन अलॉन्ग विद दैट क्वेश्चन कैन बी इन द फॉर्म ऑफ असेशन एंड रीजनिंग इवन वी मे गेट अ थेरी क्वेश्चन विच विल बी बेस्ड ऑन मेथड्स और फंक्शन ऑल राइट देन वी आर रेडी टू सॉल्व इट इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी नीड टू फाइंड आउट द करेक्ट आउटपुट देर इज वन स्ट्रिंग एंड वी आर अप्लाइंग स्प्लिट फंक्शन ऑन द स्ट्रिंग बाय डिफॉल्ट स्प्लिट फंक्शन स्प्लिट्स द स्ट्रिंग बेस्ड ऑन स्पेस That's why after applying split function on the string, we will be getting one list named L with these elements. These are the strings. In the next statement, we could see that we are applying some functions on the elements of the list, which are string. With the upper function, the string got converted to upper case. So the output will be upper case Python word. followed by that we are taking the element l of 1 l of 1 is the word is so as it is we will be getting it after that we are applying capitalize method which converts the first alphabet of the string to upper case so lower case one will get converted to the string like this with the join function we are joining this string with the dash that's why the dash will come in between these words so when we will print it the output will look like this hope you understood this explanation for that you should be aware with all the operations functions as well as methods associated with string it's time to check out the next question this question is based on string slicing look at the slicing part this is the starting index this is ending index and step is also mentioned here ending index and the step is exclusive from the negative step it is clear that we have to consider negative indexing starting index it is minus 2 so we will be starting with the letter c look at the end index it is mentioned as 2 2 is equivalent to minus 13 ending index is exclusive so we will be considering it till minus 12 here step is minus 2 and step is also exclusive it means step is minus 1 what does it mean we need to skip one character while slicing so let's start slicing from the letter c we will consider c then skip n then we will consider e skip d after that we will consider i skip s followed by that let's consider e skip r after that we will consider p skip space the last character is zero that we will consider so after slicing this is the final string and this string is present in the option b so the correct option is b the question based on slicing is very important surely you will get one question there is a dedicated video in which we have covered lot of questions so i would recommend you to go through this video and practice all the questions so you will get an idea of all the types of questions which are based on string here is the string and based on this provided index we need to do the slicing there are two parts this is the first part which is getting concatenated with the second part look at the first part starting index is 2 and the ending index is mentioned as 6 but we will take up to 5 so from this slicing we will get the string l c o m now let's consider the second slicing part the starting index is 5 so we will consider from here and the ending index is mentioned as 9 but we will consider till 8 and with the concatenation operator the second slicing part will get concatenated with the previous string so here is the previous string from the next slicing part we will get m e then space and the last character is t now look at the option b it is getting match with our answer so the correct option is b let's practice one more question which is based on string slicing Before you start slicing make sure you are clear with the starting index ending index and step 
look at the starting index it is minus 2 it means we have to start slicing from the backward direction let's write the index this is minus 1 this is nothing but minus 2 all right from c we have to start slicing we can see end is not mentioned so we have to consider the whole string according to the step every second character we have to consider let's start writing the character first of all we will get c skipping one character and consider the second one so we will get e now skip one character consider next one it is nothing but space now skip one character consider the next one that is nothing but l again skip one character consider the second one that is o skip one character there is no more character left ultimately here is the final output hope you also got the same output let's move ahead to the next question here we have theory question in which we need to mention the building functions or methods for the following instructions let's read the first one to display the given string as in capital letters to convert all the characters to the capital letters we have method upper that we are applying on the string s we need to display so for that we will be using print function it's time to read the second one we have to display the number of words we already know the split method which will split the string based on space it means we will get the words after applying split function we get list of the string and we are applying len function on the list with the help of len function we will get the number of words it means our task is done let's use print statement and print it that was so simple isn't it in this question we need to identify the output of the following code look at the code carefully here is one string we are applying replace function on the original string and creating a new string the name of the new string is same as previous one it means we will override it in the last video we have discussed all the methods and the functions associated with the string hope you remember it then tell me what this replace method will do it will replace this search value with the new value do we have it yes we have it it means hash symbol will get replaced on this string look at the options carefully well done you got the correct option that is nothing but a all right let's move ahead pause the video and try it yourself hope you got it right let's check out what we are doing here is one string with the for loop we are iterating over each character of the string now we are clear with the usage of replace method star will get replaced on d when we will print string one what will be the output this code looks very easy but there is a catch we are applying the replace function on the original string but we are not initializing it to a new string and you know string is immutable we cannot change the content in place it means original string will not get changed it will be as it is so when we will print the string one we will get the original string and that is in the option d so d is the correct choice hope you found this question very interesting let's move ahead to the next question if you have focused on the explanation of split you will know the answer all right when we mention the delimiter based on the delimiter the string will get split all right let's check out where we could find n the first place is this here also we got one n and there is one more n it means we will get total four words that will get in the form of list now look at the output very good b is the correct option we have total four elements and that too in the form of list all right let's move ahead there is one more question based on split method i will suggest the same pause the video and solve it yourself with the hope that you got correct output let's solve together here is split function along with that we have slicing too yes we can write slicing in this way too let's first work out on the first task here delimiter is mentioned as hash so based on hash this string will get split so here is the list of the string you will be getting are you confused with the last string 
in the given string next to n we have hash symbol so based on this also the string will get split but after hash there is nothing that's why we are getting one empty string first task is done now let's work out on the second task this is related to slicing let's write the index 0 1 2 we have to start slicing from 1 what is the ending index it is minus 1 but ending index is always exclusive we have to take one less than the mentioned ending index it is negative so let's mention first minus 1 and minus 2 so ending index will be minus 2 it means from f to n we will get the slice string look at the options yes you are right the correct option is b Hope you are enjoying this session. If so, don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. There is one more theory question. I am leaving up to you. This is your assignment. Let me know the answer in the comments below. We have to name the string function which returns the index value of the first occurrence of the character in the string. Otherwise, it returns minus one. Hope you got an idea the types of questions you will be getting on the string. If you want to practice some more questions. feel free to go through this video where we have covered lot of questions from the previous sample papers there are some questions which are from the actual board papers too with that let's wrap today's video in the next video we are moving to solve output based questions on string so stay tuned and stay curious and most importantly keep studying see you in the next video